Beloved ones of light, in many soul reveals you are being told that communing in your origin is done continually. Realize the power this brings to your awareness in the density of earth. If souls in the higher realms find bliss and contentment by communing with spirit, how magnificent would the changes be in your life on earth? For you are spirit and an absolute expression of one creator. The unnameable one has an unlimited variety of names given. Each religion calls forth a name that creates discord for another doctrine. Wars rage on in these names without understanding that spirit never divides, takes sides or declares war. War is a concept on earth that does nothing but create more hatred, division and greater wars. Stop and listen. Pause your hardwired beliefs and know that you are the divine essence in form, for it could not be otherwise. You did not appear out of nowhere to become an infinite soul of light. You did not receive such a gift of wisdom, love and direction from the ethers of nothingness. You are everything good and sacred that has ever been. Why would anyone ever doubt the power of knowing their connectedness to life itself? Breathe deeply. There you are. You simply forgot for a moment. You are God. Prophets in ancient dreams spoke of this truth and were killed immediately. The one you know as Yeshua or Jesus of Nazareth spoke these words as he reminded the rulers of that time of the scripture stating, Do you not know that it is written that you are all gods? And further he stated that the kingdom of God is within you. How could this mean anything but that God is part of you? This powerful beloved soul of Merapi was Elder Sananda in form. He understood his power and spoke to others of the light carried within. Let's discuss the importance and gifts available to those that learn to commune with Source. Pleiadians called the Great Spirit of Love, Elako. For the understanding of God or Source in a name that brings you comfort, know in truth, there is no ego involved in spirit. Love as you will. Communing is being still and going within. Taking your personal awareness to a quiet place of being where thoughts are not needed and peace abounds is the gift you are giving to yourself. In this stillness, your soul feels light as the personality of earth aligns and the path opens to peace. There is no doubt to each being that discovers the enormity of expansion and bliss that avails here, that this is the ultimate experience of God. You are one in this love. The more you visit this place of tranquility, the greater contentment you will find in your life. The intention to make communing a priority will allow greater communication with others. There will be more unity, less division, greater awareness, and less competition than ever in your life. The reasons for meditation with communing are endless, and this discovery will become the greatest asset to your being than you ever could have imagined. So simple and yet so profound. In the greatest care and love, we remind you of the gift you carry within. Activating your light is as simple as finding that you truly are the love of God. In love we live as one. N-E-K-E-M-I-E-A. I love you so. Laka. Original title. Communing with Source. Pleiadians of 7D Tegeta received telepathically by Judith Lin at Family of Tegeta on X. Thank you for watching Universal Lighthouse Galactic Messages and Spiritual Teachings. Please use your own personal discernment on all content posted. If you enjoyed the different authors that are shared, please subscribe to their content as well. You can visit our blog page at universallighthouse.com and subscribe to receive daily posts via your email. And while you are there, tune in to Universal Lighthouse Radio broadcasting 24-7 for your vibrational needs. Again, that's universallighthouse.com.